You think dinosaurs are extinct? Think again. What if I told you some of Earth's most ancient beasts never truly died out? They didn't vanish. They adapted, hid, survived. While their cousins became bones in museums, these creatures just kept going. They've lived through asteroid strikes, supervolcanoes, mass extinctions, and ice ages. And today, they're still crawling, slithering, swimming, and watching from the shadows. You've heard the phrase living fossil, but what you're about to see goes far beyond that. These are real-life prehistoric beasts, unchanged for tens or even hundreds of millions of years. They shared the Earth with dinosaurs, and some might be older than any land animal you've ever seen. This isn't science fiction, this is science fact. Here are seven prehistoric monsters that still walk among us, and trust me, you won't believe number one. It looks like a rusted helmet from a forgotten war. And that's fitting, because this creature has survived every mass extinction event in Earth's history. The horseshoe crab has been crawling along the ocean floor for over 450 million years. To put that into perspective, they were thriving before trees even existed. Their hard shell, blade-like tail, and 10 eyes make them look like armored tanks from another world. But it's their blood that makes them priceless. Horseshoe crab blood is bright blue, and it contains a substance called Limulus amoebocyte lysate, LAL, which instantly clots around bacteria. That means every vaccine, IV drip, and surgical implant you've ever received, it was tested using LAL. So not only are these crabs ancient survivors, they're literally keeping humans alive today. During full moons in spring, thousands of them crawl ashore to spawn in a synchronized dance older than humanity itself, a ritual echoing through the epochs. And in 2021, scientists began using synthetic alternatives to their blood to reduce harvesting, but nothing beats the original. When scientists pulled a strange, scaly fish out of a net in 1938, they thought it was a joke. This thing, over six feet long, with leg-like fins, was supposed to have gone extinct 66 million years ago. It was the coelacanth, a deep-sea legend, alive and blinking. This creature belongs to a lineage that goes back 400 million years. Its limb-like fins resemble the first vertebrates to crawl onto land, making it a critical piece in the puzzle of evolution. Coelacanths are elusive, hiding in underwater caves more than 600 feet deep. They give live birth, can live up to 100 years, and have a unique hinge in their skull allowing them to open their mouths extraordinarily wide. The coelacanth isn't just a survivor, it's a time traveler, swimming through our modern age with bones forged in the Devonian seas. If evolution had a nightmare, it would look like the goblin shark. With a flattened snout, translucent skin, and a jaw that shoots forward like a bear trap, this shark is one of the oldest and strangest predators alive. It first appeared around 125 million years ago and hasn't changed much since. Found in the dark abyssal zones over 4,000 feet deep, the goblin shark uses electroreceptors in its nose to sense prey. When something wanders too close, it extends its entire jaw forward at lightning speed. Most sightings come from trawlers accidentally pulling them up from the deep. Their flabby bodies aren't built for our world. They belong to the darkness. This isn't the shark you fear in shallow waves. This is the one that ruled the ocean trenches before mammals existed. Slippery, silent, and massive, the Chinese and Japanese giant salamanders are the largest amphibians in the world. Measuring up to six feet long, they resemble something caught mid-transformation between fish and lizard. Their lineage dates back over 170 million years. They live in cold, fast-flowing mountain streams breathing through their porous skin and feeding on insects and small fish. Their wrinkled appearance helps increase surface area for respiration, an adaptation that's remained unchanged since the Jurassic. Once revered in ancient Asian cultures as water dragons, these amphibians are now critically endangered due to habitat loss and illegal hunting. Their eerie vocalizations, likened to a baby crying, echo through the streams at night. It's no wonder locals thought they were spirits, and yet, despite humanity's damage, these creatures refuse to vanish. 
The Amazon River is home to many monsters, but few are as ancient or as awe-inspiring as the Arapaima. Stretching over 10 feet long and weighing up to 500 pounds, this armored fish has lungs and can breathe air, surfacing every 15 minutes like a crocodile. Its lineage stretches back over 100 million years, with thick scales that repel piranha bites and a feeding style that involves creating a vacuum to suck in prey, the Arapaima is perfectly suited for survival. They glide silently through the murky waters, their red-tinged bodies fading into the shadows. Indigenous tribes speak of them with reverence, part fish, part myth. Despite being fished nearly to extinction, conservation efforts are slowly bringing them back, because you don't erase 100 million years of dominance that easily. In fact, some experts believe undiscovered species of Arapaima may still dwell deep in uncharted parts of the Amazon. Imagine a creature so perfect, evolution stopped trying. The Nautilus has remained nearly unchanged for over 500 million years, half a billion years. It floats through the ocean using jet propulsion. Its shell is a logarithmic spiral divided into chambers, which it fills or empties with gas to move up or down in the water column, like a living submarine. It has no modern eyes, no complex brain, and yet it thrives. Nautiluses were once hunted for their beautiful shells, but international protections are helping populations recover. They remain hidden in deep Indo-Pacific waters, quietly floating like ghosts through coral canyons. If you ever see one in the wild, remember, you're staring into the eyes of something older than dinosaurs, trilobites, or trees, and it may just be staring back. Crocodiles didn't just survive the asteroid that wiped out the dinosaurs, they thrived. Their ancestors date back over 200 million years. Ancient crocs once walked on land, some even galloped, others hunted in open seas. Today's crocodiles are smaller, but every bit is lethal. Their bodies are armored with bone-hard scoots, their jaws snap shut with 3,700 pounds of force. They can slow their heartbeat to two beats per minute, and they'll wait unmoving for hours, until the moment is right. Found in rivers across Africa, Asia, and Australia, they ambush prey with uncanny precision. And perhaps most chilling, their strategy hasn't changed. Because when evolution builds the perfect killer, why fix it? Modern crocodiles are so ancient, scientists say they predate flowering plants. These beasts remember the world before color, 